You can translate documents from any language into another language simply by using Microsoft Word. To begin, let's open up a document in Microsoft Word. This is a welcome letter that I've edited. Uh, it's one that I've used before, and I want to change this from English to Spanish. So to get started, I want to save a different copy of my document. You can see this is Welcome Sample 2. And then I want to go up to the top section here, and I want to choose the Review ribbon right here. Once I've selected the review ribbon, I can find right next to check accessibility, I have a translate button. When I use the drop down menu, I can translate either a section of my work or my entire document. We're going to translate the entire document here. When I select this, it opens up a translator pane off to the right hand side. Now I still have the choice to translate just the section or my entire document. So I'm going to choose document and I'm going to choose translating from English. Now this should auto detect the language that you're using, but if it doesn't, it's always good just to tell it if you know. And I want to translate this into Spanish. So I need to scroll down a little bit here and a little bit further and select Spanish. So now I'm translating from English to Spanish and I simply select the translate button. Now this will take a minute or two. Once my translation has gone through, you can see it took my original work and translated it into my new language, in this case Spanish. It's translated the entire document and most of my formatting has stayed the same. There will be a couple changes in formatting, so you need to keep an eye on that. For example, at the bottom here, my signature page has gone a little bit awry. So I want to select that and I can choose either body text or normal and that'll help put that right back the way that I wanted it. Once you have everything translated, now I can go up to File and Save as a new document. Again, you want to make sure that you're making a copy of your document before changing the original. That way you'll have to. Now at the bottom, I can change my file type to a PDF, and now I have a printable version, and I want to give it a name so I know how to find it. This would be my welcome letter, for 23 and I'm going to put SP because this is the Spanish version. Now when I save it, all of my document has been translated. I have my original document still and you can see I have my original Word document, I have a translated document in both PDF as I've saved it and in the Word format. Now I'm free to print it out for any family that may need it and my students have easier access into any documents that I have. They simply open it and the work is done for them.